Hello and welcome to day 29 of 30 Days of Night, a photo marathon where I shoot one roll of film every day for 30 days with 30 cameras. Except today I'm not going to be shooting with a roll of film, but a pack of it. I'm going to be shooting with this Polaroid One Step LAN camera. Well, that definitely worked. There are definitely a few places in Alberta that I haven't taken you to yet, but today I am gonna take you to one of them. For me, it'll take me over an hour to get there. For you, it'll be a nice, smooth time-lapse. Okay, I just took my first shot and I'm waiting a couple of minutes for it to develop just to make sure I got the exposure right. They're taking a really long time to develop, but I'm gonna keep moving and hope for the best. Okay, I'm in Canmore now and the film has had at least 15 minutes to develop. Let's have a look. Okay, they definitely developed. Do I like the color? Not really. We'll see how the rest go, but I'm definitely gonna have to underexpose. Okay, I found two hour parking and I'm on the move. I'm telling you, coming down here with only eight shots is torture. And as it stands, I only have three left. <laughs> Sounds stupid, but I'm trying to get a little closer to this mountain here. Yeah, I know. Dumb idea. As soon as I got up close, the mountain disappeared behind the house. The hard part is that I've basically got a 50 millimeter focal length. Looks like a storm could be coming. Now that's some interesting color. I had a look at the shots, they've been turning out They've been turning out, let me put it that way. Um, they're not color correct, that's for sure. Okay, I've got just one shot left. Uh, I'm heading back to the car. 
I'm gonna save that one for probably on the way home if I don't see anything. Actually, I've walked past this thing up here a couple times with the motorhome. I think that's what I'm gonna take my shot of. Okay, I got all my shots and I'm on my way home to scan them. Here are today's highlights. I like this one. I think it suits the project as a whole and I'm really glad I got that boom box in the shot. the images to be cold, but for this one, it seems to work. Here's my top pick for today. I'm really glad I got something nice in the foreground and the background. I think the composition is good, the river does a bit, a bit of an S-curve, and uh, it looks like a shot taken on the countryside, but it's in town. <laughs>